Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be seeing who statistic statistically is better, me or Master Squid. Now, Master Squid is extremely overpowered in a lot of things, but, uh, well, me, not to brag or anything, but in precision-wise of clicking, you know, ya yeah boy. So, the ups of being Proud Camp are I have uh, 60 to 80 clicks per second right now at the time being, and I haven't practiced in a while, but I still have that, so I could probably get past 100. I have 60 to, uh, 60 to 80 CPS. Um, I am 75% uh, good at, uh, like, going around and, like, my precision in, like, attacking people. That's 75%. My rage level... Uh, I would give myself a 5 or 6 out of 10 for the time being because the switchers and the aimbotter is so trash. And, like, uh, all of the stuff that I do YouTube channel editing-wise, I believe that I have a 10 out of 20 editing-wise because there are people that are better than me. But now let's talk about... <clears throat> Master Squid stats. Master Squid stats are fairly high too. So, for Master Squid, he, in jitter clicking, can get 15 CPS to 16 CPS. That's just jitter clicking. For drag clicking, he can get past 20 CPS. I don't know if he can go past 30 yet, but he can definitely get past 20. And for butterfly clicking, 16 CPS, same as jitter clicking. For his precision at fighting people, it's about a 90% because of his combos. And he has also macros that enable him to switch faster than anybody else. And he can also use an auto clicker to do that too. So on my side, for all of the uh, gaming wear that I have... I have a I have two keyboards. One is a Corsair, one is a uh Ornatochroma by Razer. Uh I have six mice, all different types of mice from all different uh companies. The best mice uh, mouse I use is my Black Web one that allows me to get 60 to 80 CPS, but I usually use the Mamba Elite to the Mamba Wireless to get more uh, precision out of my gameplay because it's a more expensive mouse and nicer. On Master Squid's side, he has a better recorder. He also uh, can edit on the computer like I can't. I have to edit on mobile. He does very good edits in PvP compilations. He's more devoted to his work than other people uh, would say. In the old Booga, I would completely wreck him if we all had uh, heals because I have pretty much an infinite stream of uh, sort of like blood fruit that he can't kill me with. But without heals, he would definitely kill me, as you could see in one of his videos. In the new Booga, he can still kill me. I've killed him once before and stuff like that happening that uh, I, I've killed him once before in a public server 1v1 and he's actually very well he's able to beat me uh probably about 75 percent of the time ever and his stats are really high up there for his side he doesn't have very many mice anymore he only has maybe one or two the black web that he got and the uh g602 of the Logitech series. He has a laptop that uh, allows him to record and stuff, and it's a very nice gaming laptop that he uses. And I don't have a laptop. I have to record at an outside place. Um, so money-wise, I bet he has way more. Uh, the sort of 
the gaming wear wise he doesn't have as much as me but he definitely has more money because he has a laptop so st st statistically master squid is better than me in the new booga in the old booga i would beat him if we all had heals again new booga he is completely overpowered with his macro and his switching abilities and his combos that he does he is overpowered and i would say he is in the top 20 best players on booga booga right now thank you for tuning in to this epical video that i have made go watch my other videos and peace out